Welcome back to the New Steerman Restorers Association website. Again, Brian Rosenstein here, your membership director and secretary. I wanted to talk to you about the members only section of the new website. You'll notice there is no members only section, and that's simply because we're not logged in yet. Once you've logged into the website, the members only tab appears at the top, and you'll notice a drop down menu. Before we talk about each item on the drop down menu, we want to press right on the members only tab to go to the members only homepage. On the members only homepage, we're going to be uploading articles from the latest magazine and some magazines from the past. There's some upcoming events as well. We have featured lifetime members that will be scrolling through here as well. And we also have added our membership directory. We will be issuing PDF version of the membership roster that uh, you folks like to get. We'll be uploading that to the forum in the announcements section. But if you'd like to find a member on the website, you can type in their name in the search bar and look up their contact info. So for example, if you wanted to look up El Presidente here, you can look up Mike Rutledge, click on his name, and his contact information will be presented for you. If you'd like to send him a message directly, we've got this great feature here that uh, we're really happy to have right there. Send a message. So if you click on send a message, it will email them directly to the email address that we have on file for them. So enter in your message subject in your body and click send. And of course, uh, they will get that in their email inbox. Going back up to the mem members only section here, you'll notice the drop down menu. There's a couple of items on the drop down menu that we are uh, going to show you today. And we're going to have a couple more videos for you just to expand on some of those items. But the first item on the list is the knowledge archive. If you click on that, uh, essentially, what is the Knowledge Archive? Well, it is the previous forum. The website that we are coming from uh, had almost 20 years, more than 4,000 posts worth of really valuable information, tips and techniques, restoration suggestions, um, maintenance suggestions on keeping these airplanes flying, and we didn't want to lose that valuable resource. So we have transplanted that old forum into what is now called the Knowledge Archive. We've organized it into helpful categories for you, and we will do a third video kind of describing how to make the Knowledge Archive work for you. Going back up to the Members Only section, the next uh, item on the list is the Document Library, something we're really proud of. We had a lot of demand from the membership to uh, have documents available for people to use as a resource. For example, uh, the erection and maintenance manual, we have overhaul manuals, uh, pilots operating handbooks, we've got the Stearman annual inspection checklist as well as the type certificate data sheet. All you have to do is click on any one of these links to open up a PDF version of this document. You can save them, you can print them, and uh, you can view them at your discretion. These of course are free for you, the members. Really excited about that. Back up to the members only bar, uh, we've got the magazine. Click on the magazine page, and we're going to be uploading the last four magazines in PDF format so you can view them on your computer. Uh, just click on the download link, and you'll be able to see any one of the last four issues of the magazine right there. Okay. Going back up to the members only section, we have incorporated an online store for you, much like any other online store. Uh, you can click on any of these items and with a credit card purchase any of the things that otherwise in the past you would have to call us, email us, and uh, manually uh, conduct that transaction. But now you can use the store to purchase items that you might be interested in. It will accept credit cards. However, if you're still interested in sending us a personal check or using PayPal, uh, we can still do those transactions manually. Just give us an email. We'll be happy to do that for you. Back up to members only, and we're coming down to the support and submit function. We love the feedback of our members. So we've given you this uh, form to be able to give us feedback, whether it's for the website or whether it's about your membership. If you have questions or comments, feel free to fill out either of these forms, and we'll get that feedback. On the right side of the page here is our magazine subs uh, submissions form. So if you'd like to contribute content for the next Flying Wire magazine, whether it's an article, uh, whether it's just a photograph, uh, this is where you're going to be able to do that. So you put in your name, email address, phone number, and the details of your submission. And then down here in the upload box, you'll notice we can upload a file. So you can do that right there. And then we will get those uh, 
submissions for consideration for the next magazine. Again, we're always looking for content. We're happy to have you guys uh, give us your submissions. And the last item under the members only tab is the forum. Now we have this secondary drop down menu here that shows you which forums we've created, but the forum homepage can be accessed by clicking directly on the forums button. The forum homepage will show you the last messages that were posted and it'll give you a summary of all of the five forums that we have created for you. The announcements forum is really just to, for the SRA to give out information to the membership. We'll be posting more videos in the announcements forum here regarding how to use the document library, how to uh, use the knowledge archive, things like that. We'll be posting some helpful things in there for you. And then of course we've created the classified section for sale and wanted items. Uh, general discussion and restoration or maintenance discussion in the forums section. If you do need any more contact information, feel free to click on the Contact Us tab, and all of our contact information is presented for you. Again, we're always happy to have your feedback. Uh, you can email us directly. Uh, if you want to contact me at sramemberinfo at gmail.com, feel free to do so, or if you want to contact our uh, our graphic designer, SRA graphic designer at gmail.com. Feel free to do that if you do not want to use the submit and support page that we've created for you. We uh, will be making a few more videos just to help you folks uh, transition to the new website. We hope you enjoy it. Feel free to contact us with, uh, with any information.